Good evening and welcome to the next episode of Kentucky's Kingdom by Michael Morpergo. And today's chapter is called Everyone Dead in Nagasaki. And if you remember at the end of chapter 7, Kensuke was taking, was taking Michael, or as he calls him, Mika-san, and Stella the dog, he's taking them out fishing on the east coast of the island, where he says they're going to catch a big fish. And today we learn a lot more about the history of Kensuke. So, let's get to it. I was overjoyed. I had found a part of me that I thought I had lost forever. Now, Kensuke said, beaming at me. Now, you happy person, my Kassan. I happy too. We go fishing. I tell you very soon where I find this ball. Very soon I tell you everything. Little fish not so good now. Not so many. We need big fish, sometimes from deep sea. We smoke fish. Then we always plant we have always plenty fish to eat. You understand? Right, so they're in this large canoe. It's called a an outrigger. So let's go over to the outrigger. And here we are, we've got Kensuke. We've got Kensuke at the back, Michael in the middle, and Stella's Stella's on the on the uh, on the bow of the boat. There they are, out in the open ocean. The outrigger was a great deal heavier than it looked. I helped Kensuke drag it down to the beach and into the sea. This very good boat, he said, as we lifted Stella in. This boat never go down. I make myself very safe boat. He pushed us off and jumped in. I never ceased to be amazed at his extraordinary agility and strength. He rowed with a single oar, standing in the stern of the boat, more as if he was punting. Very soon we were out beyond the shelter of the cove and into the swell of the open sea. Clutching my beloved football and with Stella at my feet, I sat watching him and waiting for him to begin his story. I knew better than to pester him by now. The fishing came first. We baited our lines and settled silently to our fishing, one over each side of the boat. I was bursting to ask him about the football, about how he'd found it, but I dared not, for fear he would clam up and say nothing. It was some time before he began, but when he did, it was well worth waiting for. So now, everybody, we are going to find out who Kensuke is. Now I tell you everything, my Kassan, he said. Like I promise, I am old, but it is not long story. I am born in Japan, in Nagasaki. Very big town, by the sea. I grow up in this town. When I young man, I study medicine in Tokyo. Soon I am doctor, Dr. Kensuke Ogawa. I very proud person. I look after many mothers, many babies too. I first person many babies see in world. Then I go to London. I do studies in London, Guy's Hospital. You know this place? I shook my head. Of course, I learn speak little English there. Afterwards, I came back to Nagasaki. I have beautiful wife, Kimi. Then I have little son too, Michia. I very happy person in those days. Wow. So Kensuke was a Japanese doctor from Nagasaki. And he went to work in London at the hospital. And he has a wife, he had a wife, Kimi, and a son too, Michia. So how on earth did Kensuke end up on this island? But soon, my Kassan. War comes. All Japanese men are soldiers now. Sailors, maybe. I go to Navy. I doctor on big warship. Aha, so he had to join the Navy during the war, the Japanese Navy, who, of course, were fighting against the Americans and the British and the Canadians and Australians. So they were our enemies at that time. A fish took on his line and took his bait but not the hook. He went on as he rebaited his hook. This war, very long time ago now. I did know something about a war with Japan. I'd seen it in films, but I knew very little about it. He shook his head. Many die in this war. This war, very terrible time. 
Many ships go down. Japanese army win many battles. Japanese navy win many battles. All Japanese very happy people. Like football. When you win, you happy. When you lose, you sad. I go home often. I see my Kimi and my little Michia in Nagasaki. He grow fast. Already big boy. We are all very happy family. Right, so, Kensuke's describing how the war was at first good for him. But war goes on a long time. Many Americans come, many ships, many planes, many bombs. Now war is not so good for Japan. We fight, but now we lose. Very bad time. We are in big sea battle. American planes come. My ship is bombed. There is fire and smoke, black smoke. Many men burn, many men dead. Many jump off ship into sea. But I stay, I am doctor. I stay with my patients. Planes come again. Many more bombs. I think I am dead person this time for sure. But I am not. So it sounds as if Kensuke's ship uh, was attacked uh, by probably by the American Navy and the American Air Force. I look all around ship. Patients dead. All sailors dead. I am only person alive on ship, but engine still going. Ship moving on her own. She go now where she want to go. I cannot turn wheel. I can do nothing, but I listen to the radio. Right. So maybe, the so it must be the ship that's on the west-hand side of the island. If we look down at the island here, that must be the ship that was attacked with everybody dead except Kensuke. He said he couldn't control the ship, so maybe it's crashed into the island. But next, he talks about something he hears on the radio. <clears throat> I listen to radio. Americans say on radio, big bomb fall on Nagasaki. Atomic bomb. Many dead. I very sad person. I think Kimi dead. Michia dead. My mother lived there too. All my family. I think they all dead. So what Kensuke is telling us is that he found out just before he's been abandoned on this island as the ship has crashed, that he hears that Nagasaki, the large city in Japan where his family live, has been bombed by a very, very big bomb. And his wife and his young son uh, were killed. That's what he thinks. Now, before we uh, end tonight, I've got a little bit of homework for anybody's listening. What can you tell me about what happened? What can you find out during World War Two? What happened in the city of Nagasaki? It'll be easy to find out. It was a very, very important event in history. We'll find out more about what happened to Kensuke tomorrow. See you.